Well, hello, my radio friends. Now, at uh, next in Dave's menagerie, I'm bringing forward a set that is kind of unique, I think, in, in two notable ways. Um, let's start with the, the name of this set. And, and that's, uh, it was made by a company by the name of Western Coil and Electric Company. In Racine, Wisconsin, it is a model WC-17. But more importantly, I want to touch on what you see here. Here is the name. It is a Radiodyne. Radiodyne C, to be more specific. Uh, um, the reason that name is, is, is special or important, uh, however you want to word it, those of you that are savvy will recognize the name Radio Dine as a name that another manufacturer had used early on, more specifically at Water Kent. In fact, one of their, uh, their uh, early breadboards was named Radio Dine, and they were... Uh, I don't know if they were sued, but they were warned by this manufacturer we see here, Western Coil, to cease and desist using that name Radiodyne. And it's because of, of this manufacturer right here, why AK stopped using that name. No telling where it would have been. We would have probably seen a lot more Radiodynes by AK if it hadn't already been used by this company. Um, a couple, un another unique thing I think that sets this set a little bit forward, other than I think being a rather attractive set, is the whole layout inside. I think it's just a cool looking set. In fact, let me get up in here if I may. Let me slide it forward just a little bit. It, uh, one can see there is a it is a five tube set and uh, all the tubes are shot mounted but what I truly like about it is the volume control in fact allow me to show you it actually employs regen as a volume control it's uh, a five tube O1A set with regen so it is a a hot little bugger it is a good performing set i have to confess the whole circuit and when i restored this set and it needed a lot of work i must confess um though i never understood this circuitry i'm not to this to this day i don't understand why they have a very large and i don't know if i could get a focus on it here Right here is a very large, large choke, and it's in series with the plate detector of the de uh, plate circuit of the detector, I believe it was. Uh, never seen another set with such a large choke in the B plus, uh, but it does perform and it performs well. And like I could say I just think it's uh, an attractive little set. That's the front of the panel is very, very shiny black polishes up well and shows fingerprints equally as well so it uh um but it was uh just a, a neat enough set by name that i thought it warranted a spot in dave's collection the first radio dine thank you so much i appreciate y'all watching and of course as as always until next time.